Uh, for the sake smokers out there, um, I know I got, let me check who said that on my YouTube, uh, Shorty43204, saying uh, I'm super tense in my videos, and since you quit smoking, did the cigarettes help with your irritability? I think, I think it does for the short term for me, but after that, it's just... I was still irritable. I don't like the cigarettes really do anything, really. I'm just irritable in general, I guess. But this video, I'm going to talk about the withdrawals I got from smoking. I still kind of get them. Um, physical withdrawals last me a week. It was um, like constipation. Um, I like food cravings and stuff. Like, I felt more hungry. Um, what else? Felt irritable, like, like I said. Um. I had really bad insomnia, though. That's a big one for, that was a big one for me. I couldn't sleep good at all. Right on the first couple weeks, it just sucked. <laughs> Felt like I just needed to, like, stay up, like, long as fuck. I was so tempted for a cigarette. So tempted. Every time. Um. I would get cravings a lot, too. I still get cravings right now. I always feel like I need to smoke, but... <laughs> fucking, um... Yeah, I still get I still get craving. That's kind of like a withdrawal I get. Um, thing is, uh, I'm not trying to quit smoking totally. It's just I'm trying to I'm trying to like I can't afford it anymore. Like I said in my videos, and I just want to do it at, like in moderation or something. So I can't can't afford smokes when they're ten dollars a pack. Inflation just keeps going up all the time. Like, once in a while, I'm gonna buy a pack and smoke, you know, but I'm not trying to go back to, um, like doing it every day, if that makes sense. So, I'm not totally trying to quit smoking. Just don't want to do it all the time. Um, what other withdrawals did I get? Um, yeah, insomnia, I said, irritability constipation. I feel like I had to throw up like the first day. First or second day it was. I felt like I had to throw up because it felt like everything was coming up my throat. It was bad. Um, another one was um, another withdrawal. Um, say anxiety, I do feel more anxious when I was quitting. Not, I'm not as anxious anymore, though. Um, what else? Well, yeah, the withdrawals weren't too bad for me. It wasn't, like, crazy. Um... Bob is just, like, willpower to do it. Like, all these, like, nicotine patches and nicotine gum. And that shit, I think, is a waste of time. They just want money. And why would you take nicotine when you're smoking nicotine? It's not really going to help someone quit, you know? <laughs> Stupid. Like, I, I felt like when I was smoking, I mean, not smoking, huh? I was taking the nicotine patch and the gum... I felt like I needed to smoke. I remember I would be smoking with a nicotine patch on. And, uh, it just felt like it didn't work. You know what I mean? Um. Yeah. What else? Yeah. In the future, in my videos, I, I want to do cig reviews still. I still want to. It's just 
I want to be able to have a couple months where I don't feel addicted. And I feel like I'm ready to just do it for fun here and there or something. Like a SIG review. So I still think they're fun to do, man. You know? Like, I want to do SIGs that I haven't smoked yet. If that makes sense. I'm going to play another song here. Play some rock music this time. Some classic. But yeah, those are the withdrawals I got. Say the positives I'm getting. I'm able to breathe better. I'm able to smell. Like my one coworker smokes marble lights, and I can just tell what marble light smells like. But from far distance, I'm able to smell it more clear. I'm able to smell better again. Um, taste foods again too. Um, I'm able to run without getting winded. Like, like when I was smoking cigarettes, if I was running. I would be, it would have to take me a little bit to get used to, because I was, I smoked, but now I, I don't feel windy right when I run, so that's a good thing, I guess. Um, I do miss the, like, just smoking every day, smoking like this, and like, on the car, but I gotta save my money, which sucks. Everything's too expensive nowadays, so... Yeah, but those are the withdrawals and the positive, I guess the positives of quitting, I guess. But I'm not totally quitting smoking. It's just, we'll be having cig reviews sometime in the spring or summer. Or maybe some, most likely summer. So, 